Hi everyone. So today I just did how I make my YouTube banner. If you guys would like to see it, keep on watching. So the first thing you want to do is you actually want to bring up your YouTube page and you want to go to where your banner is. There should actually be a pencil and you want to click edit channel art and then it'll bring up this and then you want to click on how to create channel art. I actually already brought the page up. This is what it would look like. There are two links. There's Photoshop and Fireworks. I actually downloaded the Fireworks one. So from here now you want to go to like Google and search like Tumblr backgrounds or just backgrounds and you want to pick which background you want to use. I actually already have a background that I want to use that I found on Pinterest. And then from here you want to choose which background you want to use or whatever. And this is the background I will be using. I already have it saved into my computer. Um, so from here now you want to like search like overlays like I said. Um, I already have my overlays picked out. And then you want to um, pick your overlays out. These are just some of the ones that I pinned on Pinterest. I chose some of those. Then from here now you want to go to pickmonkey.com. You want to click edit. And you want to bring up that template that you saved earlier. I'm actually going to close out some of these pages to make it go a little bit more faster. So from so what you want to do is you want to make sure that you keep it in this area this gray area is like is good but any other farther it won't even show up on your banner um so what you want to do is you want to make sure you stay in between the tablet mark and then you want to go to text So I'm going to now be picking Blackjack. I have not used this one on my banners. I do like to use different text on each of my banners. The same thing goes with my thumbnails too. So here you want to type in whatever you want to type in. I'm just going to be typing in my, my YouTube name. Then from here you want to change the color or the size. Then from here you want to go to the butterfly over here which is overlays. They do have their own overlays you can use but I'm going to be using my own overlays. Then from here you want to go to your eraser and make the picture bigger so you can actually see. Um, and then you want to, I'm going to be putting my harshness down. And then once you're done with that, you can reposition the picture. And now I'm going to be adding in my other overlays. Go up to the second tab over here, which is effects. You want to go down to the um, section where it says artsy and you want to do draw. And you want to make sure that it's on white and that the brush size is big. That way you can just easily click over and do this.
So the things you actually want to do is you actually want to go back and actually move your um, those things, the overlays, just to make sure that you didn't miss a spot. And then now you actually want to go and add your picture. And then now you actually want to click on your um, overlays and you want to choose a blend mode so you can't see that white anymore. And then from here you can actually move your overlays, resize anything you want to. And then this one I'm just going to do shadows into light too. And then now you just want to resave your new template picture. So I'll just save it as new template to dot jpg. Adjust the crop if you have to and then select. So that's how I make my YouTube banner. If you guys like the video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and thank you for watching. Bye.